Hey guys, in this video I will be sharing about 1.4 events and some tips also. Okay, first we got 20 banner once again. And that's not all, we will have Rosaria available in the next banner and her element is Cairo and she is a spear user. She is a 4 star and I'm sure you are all excited to see her, right? Okay, let's get to the events. With the 1.4 we got new quest. When you go to your quest, here you can see story quest and then you have to click here which is called hangout. So for now there's only 4 characters, later on we will have more. So here you have to, you need 2 keys to unlock one story and then when you click the rewards here, if you unlock all the endings, you will get all these rewards. For example, you will be getting um, talent level up material, also primo gems which is really great and adventure xp which you can use to increase your adventure rank and then there, let's see the challenges when you go to your events you can see here invitation of wind bloom let's take the event show here there are a lot of great items which you can use for your game uh, but make sure you buy this crown of insight because you need this item to max your talent and it's so rare we don't really see this anywhere in the game we get this only in events like this so make sure to buy this and the rest it's all up to you which one you like then there's the other shop which you need the blue tickets here you can get a bow and you can buy this the visible wins to refine that bow so it's a really great chance to have a good weapon with a bunch of like yeah you can max it you can max refine it and there are other items which can be really useful i'm not into the bow much so i exchange these items so it's up to you according to your need you can get what you want all right let's see about these challenges so if you want to get the red tickets you have to go to festive challenges here you will learn these tickets and if you need the blue tickets you have to go to peculiar wonderland here by doing this challenge you will get the blue tickets you will get this every time you will get 200 every time you complete one dungeon let's say domain you will get 200 per domain and there are extra quests like if you uh, do this for example if you complete the peculiar wonder and while finishing one way traffic within 40 seconds you get these two rewards so it's like that and make sure to you do you finish all your attempts so when the next challenge comes you can finish it also Alright, uh, next there is festive, it's hard to pronounce that, <laughs> here you will get 100 primo gems per each chapter you finish, so I'm on chapter act 3 now, soon after 3 hours act 4 will be unlocked and then the new quest will be unlocked, alright, so when it comes to First two challenges, I have some tips for you guys. Uh, actually, I have seen this in the comments. In some of you have been asking like how to get the third reward here. Which you need high amount of points to get that reward. So it's really easy. If you think about the bullseye balloons, uh, there's a way. It's something that we all have already forgotten. For example, let's go here. Alright, in these challenges, the thing that most of you have already forgotten is that we have a mood in this game. Uh, even some of my friends, some of my viewers has asked me, how did you get the third reward so easily? 
so what some of you guys have been doing is you hold and aim shoot hold aim shoot so there's a there's an animation here there's animation delay here so you don't have to do that you just in the pc you just have to click r and then yeah you're on the aim mode you just you just move and then you just shoot Alright, the next challenge that uh, I have been getting questions is about this Ballads of Breeze here It's also the same thing but it's a bit different Here what you have to do is you have to do the normal mood first And then you have to do the hard mood And then you have to do the pro mood to get the highest score For example, I won't be doing this now But if you select the pro mode, the music plays for a longer time so that means you have enough time to get the score which is needed to get the third reward. Alright. So that's it for this guide guys and thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful and I hope you guys learned something new. Alright, see you guys. Thank you for watching.